for YouTube friends and family. So, y'all gonna be so mad at me, but I've been trying to do a whole video forever. You have no idea. The state of my room is a complete wreck. Things in my life aren't that much of a wreck, but you know. So yeah, I went to Paris last month for my cousin's wedding in September, the first week of September. It was amazing. It was great. Spent a week there with my mom, my cousin, and my aunt. And the wedding was four hours outside the city of Paris in a city called Cholet. It was good. And I did do a vlog on it, so I'm going to show you guys the vlog. It's my first vlog overseas. I'm so excited. I really hope that you like it. And I hope it's cute and all that good stuff. Um, Because competition out there with vlogs is thick. So I was real scared doing my video like, oh my god, I don't know if it's going to be good enough. Like, whatever. So hopefully you like it. I'm going to jump into the haul and I won't blab anymore because I know you've been waiting for this. Like, the jump up. Whew. Let me breathe. Woosa, I got so excited to see you guys. I'm like, crack it. Like, anyway, while I was in Paris, I went to a bunch of places. Of course, I had to shop my butt off. So I went to a lot of different places. Mainly, though, I stuck to my face, Bershka, Stradivarius, um, Zara, of course. And I told you guys, like I've told you many times before, Zara is like legit 40 to 60% off overseas than it is here in New York or in the States. So when I go overseas, you better believe Mama's going to come back and show you something from Zara. So I'll jump right into it. The first thing I got was from Bershka. This is a pair of um, light blue jeans. And over the summer, these were trending. I'm so mad. I bought these in September. And I'm just showing it to you. But like the shredded bottom, you can definitely DIY this. I've seen a couple um, DIYs on Pinterest and they look really cute. But these are on sale for like 12 euro. So for 12 euro, I'm not DIY. Um, and then FYI for Bershka jeans, if you guys don't already know, Bershka has the best fitting, great quality, inexpensive jeans. Like in that order. Like best fitting, best quality, and least expensive jeans that you can ever find in the market. So if you're in the market for jeans and you happen to be overseas, um, please step into a Bershka snag you a pair or five <laughs> um because i got two on this particular haul and then i have two from the last time i went to I think to barcelona or amsterdam somewhere i don't know so then the next thing that i'm getting from Bershka is going to be these jeans again i get it some more jeans you know i thought i got it too this time too last time too i got it next time i go out I'm always happy now these jeans <laughs> they were ripped at the knee and i was at the airport waiting for a flight and i folded my leg like this and sat down and it just said <laughs> ripped right here but it's still cute because it's a ripped jean, so that kind of just went along with the trend. So these jeans at the bottom, they have like the uneven hem ripped top thing or whatever, like it's cut at the top. It's really cute. Yeah, and I thought that was really cute, and it is also a trend, and you can DIY it, but these jeans cost mama like 15 euro, I think, so mama ain't DIY nothing, honey, when it's 15 dollars. Then the next thing is two shirts. Um, this is just a long sleeve button down in the back top. I am in love with this little top. I don't know why. Are you like me with your closet? Like, you feel like you don't have enough cute tops. Like, when you're about to go out somewhere, you're like, oh, I'm going to wear a cute top of jeans and heels. And you're like, but I don't have any cute tops. Like, ooh. So I OD'd. I tried to, like, when I find a cute top, I buy it in more than one color. So, of course, I got it in white. And then again, the back button's down really really cute I also wore this to fashion week I wore the white one and it fit really cute I love it and I will be wearing it in the winter time I'm just gonna layer it with something long sleeve underneath because it's a really cute top so these are only 18 euro in Bershka and then of course because I can't get enough of the cute tops right I found this other blue and white lovely one with eyelashes how cute is that little eyelashes all over it I was so in love I thought that was adorable and then little ruffles at the end also wear this one to um, Fashion Week to the Like to Know It party. I took some pictures, but I didn't really like them, so I didn't post any to Instagram um, or anywhere else. But I love this shirt. It's really cute, and this was only 15 euro. Then, mango is everywhere all over Paris. I mean, there's a mango at every single corner. So I bought this sweater. It was actually one day that was really cold. I didn't forecast it to be that cold, so I just ran in there and bought this sweater. I think this was only 19 euro, but I love that it had the little ties on the side, and it's a nice chunkiness. And then while I was in Mango, I found this It's so cute. It's a cowhide um, purse with marble detail on the top. It's so gorgeous. 
I love the rich brown. It's just so nice. It also has a gold strap. So if you do want to take it out to the town and over your shoulder, then that's an option too. And inside, it's really small, but it's just enough to put like cell phone, couple cards, and stuff like that. But I really loved this purse. And I think it was like 29 euro or something like that. But it's cute because I need some variety in my purse collection. So I thought this was perf. Oh, you can't really see it, but you get the gist, right? Okay, on to my favorite part. Yes. So coat season. First coat I got is just this cute little bomber jacket, army green, from Bershka. This was actually $15, so I had to jump on this. I didn't have a choice, really. But I really loved it. It's nice, good quality. Like I told you guys, Bershka, you cannot be asleep on Bershka. Then I got like a cute parka, olive green parka. I always wanted one of these. And I always thought they were so cute and classy. I worked at the airport and I felt so dignified. It was nice. Um, this one was actually 39 euro. Then on to Zara. So you know I have to jump into Zara, right? Yeah, so I kind of went ham in Zara because I figured I have to get all of my winter stuff now and I don't want to be scrambling for winter stuff when winter starts because... If you know like I know and you shop like the way I shop, nothing's ever in stock. So I got all my boots, all my coats like right now. So I got this puffer coat. Puffer coats are huge, are hugely, majorly trending right now. So if you find a cute puffer coat, jump on it. So yeah, I got this puffer coat from Zara. I loved that it have it has a hoodie included, zipper in the back. Um, It's so warm. I love it so much. And it has like a little fur collar on the inside to keep you warm. Now, let me tell you about this coat. This coat retails in the U.S. for $129.99. This coat in Paris was $59.99. I was like, damn, I should buy like three. Like, what the hell? Like, you see the cost difference? And I'm trying to tell you, y'all you think I'll just be on here trying to tell you to shop. Like, oh, yeah, just blow your money. Like, no. I'm trying to get you to save money if you're going to spend money. Like, and still be cute. Anyway, this is $59. I absolutely love it. Yes, yes, and it's super fitted, so it's like everything that my dreams are made of. And then I was hunting to find a trench coat that is mine. Yeah, I was gonna find a trench coat for the longest. I mean, when I say hunting, I was in every store from J. Crew Outlet here in the States to like everywhere trying to find a trench that I absolutely adored. Great quality, structured, fitted, just everything I absolutely wanted. And nobody does coats better than Zara, honey. So, Mama got two, but I'm only going to show you one today because the other one is in the cleaner. So, I will insert a photograph of myself in the other one. And I didn't mean to get two, but I went to Zara on two different occasions and I saw the second one. I was like, oh, I'll just take back the first one. And then when I got home, I was like, no, I really love both of them. I'm going to keep all of them. So anyway, I got this khaki colored trench coat. This one is very nice. And this is the water repellent kind that when the water hits it, it rolls right off. This was only 69 euro. The other one that I got was 89 euro. When I looked at the Zara website here in this, so this is what I do when I shop, right? If you ever see me in Zara, anywhere, you're gonna see me with two things, my phone out and an arm full of stuff. My phone is going to be out because I take the Zara app and I go to scan. There's a little section that says scan and I click it. And what I do is I walk around the store and everything that I like, I scan it to see what the price comes up under Zara US. So when I scan this particular jacket, it came out to be, I think, 119 That was 69 The other one was 179 and 179 back home and I paid 89 for it. So that right there lets me know my savings, and I'm like, this is a no-brainer. Like, let me get this, let me get that, and I'll get them all, okay? So, on to the shoes. And I'm probably going to do a boot collection or a fall-winter shoe collection so that you guys can see all the shoes that I have in my collection for the fall. I'm so excited because I found some really cute boots, and I got really good prices on them. And I'm going to link all of the websites that I use to get these shoes and the deals and the prices and all of that stuff because sometimes it'd be hard to find a good deal. And I'm going to hook you up. So the first ones that I got from Zara are going to be these cute little ankle booties with little buttons on the side. And this one has the cream tip that's in right now. This is um, Zara's take on the Chanel boot. I don't know if you guys have seen the Chanel boot everywhere with the tip here. Now, my thing about that is 
I like to save money, and I like the fact that when Zara does a trend, they do their own take on the trend. It's not like a replica, it's not a duplicate, it's not a copy. It's like, oh, a boot's gonna have a white tip? Well, we're gonna do it, but we're gonna do it different. So I love that Zara did that. These were only 49 euro. Then I had to get these. Everyone knows the whole Lucite heel trend, or they call it Perspex heel. The Perspex heels trend is in right now. So I was gonna get, actually I did get some from Ego, so I will get a sh Why can't I talk? What is wrong with me? Anyway, I will show you guys those in my fall shoe collection um, at another point. But these I got from Zara Perspex, Perspex heels. Why can't I say that? Um, ankle booties, and I love that it's like the fabric kind. It's really cute. Very understated, but stated at the same time. These were only 39 euro. Then I got these over the knee boots. Like I need new over the knee boots. Like seriously, after I bought the Stuart Winesmith last year, I was like, girl, these better last me for the rest of my life. And I shouldn't look at another over the knee boot for the rest of my life. But I did. These were only 59 in Zara. So I had to like jump on it. I really didn't have a choice. Um, and it has that whole heel, the cap toe that I was saying was trending with the Chanel boot. This one is the patent leather. I like that Zara did it with two tone, two different materials. I mean, that was really cute. So these are over the knee, faux leather, not real leather. Which is another thing that had me roll my eyes like, oh, come on Zara, you could have did better. But I do like them, so I got them anyway. And then last but not least for the boots at Zara, I did get another pair of ankle boots. And these are an ivory color, so white boots are back. I know you guys are going to say, white shoes, ah, I hate them. But white boots are back, and I thought ivory was a better take on it for me because the white could be too bright, and I like that the ivory's a little bit muted. What I love more about these particular heels, look at the heel. They're so cute. So it's like a wooden type right here, then like a gold, and then followed by the leather. And these fit your ankle. Super cute. I love these. These were only 39 euro. So, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the haul. I hope it was good to ya. Um, yeah. I missed y'all. And I gotta figure this out. I bought a planner today. So I'm gonna plan my life. And plan my videos. And when and where and how and what. You know what I mean? Like, I gotta get on it. Because these ideas in my head running around isn't enough and it's kind of driving me crazy. So I gotta put them down on paper. I know I can use a phone, but I'm not a phone kind of person. I'm old school. This like visual visualizing and physically writing this allows me to process it better and allow it to manifest even better in my life. So thank you so much for watching. See you guys on my next video.